Yeah, so welcome back to a &R Talk. A couple movie news dropped and some sources. Well, a couple news dropped. Uh, two of them I'm going to go over pretty quick. One is kind of the main big one. Not get that long. Just to update you on the world. Just make sure you like and subscribe to this channel for all your movie news, trailer reactions, and videos and entertainments on the basic stuff. This is trying to watch. Um, well, the one of the main thing is that the Terminator new movie that's coming out. Is gonna be the direct sequel to Judgment Day, so it's kind of like the part three is the one right after part two. Um, James Cameron is coming back to produce it, and um, Miller, T.J. Miller, I believe, T.J. Miller, Tim Miller, um, who directed Deadpool, is coming on to direct this film. He's got the blessing and okay from um, James Cameron. The movie's been pushed from July of 2019 to November 2019. So it's just been pushed back um, like four months. Um, I think they pushed it because Lion King was there. The studio said they were been having plans to push it. Probably, um, I guess, get the script right or get the actors or contracts. I don't know what. They just pushed the movie four months back. I don't really mean much. Um, an original Sarah Connor from Terminator 1 and 2 is coming back as this Sarah, Sarah Connor. And uh, so they're bringing back the old people and stuff. So it's like I said, it's a direct sequel. So we'll see how that goes goes in there. Now off the Terminator news, now we're going into um Lord of the Rings. Amazon bid mad money. So 50 million or 500 million, I'm not sure. I can't remember the correct figures. But Amazon Studios, Amazon bought Lord of the Rings. And they're putting over a billion dollars into the project to make a five season story. Five seasons that Amazon's going to throw out for Lord of the Rings. For all you Lord of the Rings fans, there you go. That's some big news for you guys. I like the Lord of the Rings, but I wasn't like a huge fan of it. But I did love the mythology and the, the story and the, the world. That's, I was a fan of it. Just wasn't a fan of the spiders. I can't stand them shits. can't stand it. If you have more than four legs, I don't deal with you. Alright? Uh, so that's about it. Yeah, they just throw a billion dollars into stores thing. But the main big news I got today was that they even came from directors and stuff in Marvel they are taking now Thanos' backstory for screen time reasons and reasons that they're saying that it wasn't that much important the whole Marvel Cinematic Universe have been teasing Thanos in all these damn movies and stuff and now we're gonna get the movie for him finally that we've been waiting for six, seven, eight, nine years for if a movie's three, four hours, it's gonna make money. This is Marvel. Your movie's gonna make money. So you're gonna cut out like an additional five, ten minutes for screen time. Everyone wants to see Marvel, everyone wants to see Thanos, so you're gonna do it for screen time reasons. Like that five, ten minutes. Like when DC and them did that with Justice League and BVS, that was the worst thing they could have ever done. But Marvel, people don't say Marvel got a good track record. I'll get into that in another video talking about how the Marvel Cinematic Universe isn't all that much better than DC and how they get extra promotion boost over DC but they have been doing some things good though I'm not gonna lie I love it I love the cart there but off that let me let me not get into that but the whole Thanos backstory how is that not in it it, sh it should be it should be it's Thanos the biggest thing why are we gonna cut his story that's what we want to see and they're saying that oh the movie's still in Thanos point of view that you get well let's see how the movie does they just took out his backstory let me all know what you thought about this video and about the news I'm giving you. Let me know. Let me know if it was um if it was good to you or what not. Just hit that like button, hit that subscribe button for many more of this stuff. Hit the bell notification so as soon as I drop a video, go straight into your phone. You get notified. You can get right into the video. This is A and R Talk. Till next time, my name is Alex and I am.